Hi guys. I'm just stepping in on break from the North Pole. You know, I be stripping and shit. <laughs> Merry Christmas, you filthy animal. And welcome to my channel, Darrell Jones with an X on the end. Now, um, today, you know, I'm looking a little different, a little extra, a little festive. <laughs> Clearly, I've been inspired. I was inspired by James Charles. If you're not subscribed to him, oh my god, this freaking hair. It's caught in the lash. The power of the lash. Come on. Come on. I got you. No. Oh shit, that was a lash. You gotta go, bitch. Okay. If you aren't subscribed to my channel, no, I don't do drag, but I am playing in drag today, hunty. And if you're an old subscriber, no, I'm not about to start doing drag, so just don't drag it in the comments, bitch. Enough talking. If you guys would like to see how I created this look, please keep on watching. <laughs> All right, guys, so we are ready to start these eyes. I'm really scared because this is the first time that I've ever um, glued my eyebrows down and done anything over them. So this will be pretty freaking intense. And I'm like using this mirror that is like attached to this box because it's like nighttime so I can't really see. So we're gonna do the best that we can here, okay? Again, this is my first time doing a drag look, so. So since this is just a guessing game here, you know, I just do my face on the regular. I'm going to go in with this, um, flat angle brush here because I feel like this will give me the most precise line that I'm looking for and I'm going to go in with this black radiance um urban identity shadow trio and it is just the color green it's just like three different shades of green it's not that deep so I'm going to start with drawing the line for the cut crease I don't know what I'm doing guys this is going to be some bull fucking shit so let's just try to do this here we're getting somewhere. I see a line coming. And you know, I've never done a cut crease before either. So this is all just a bunch of new ass fun for me. I'm going to get the look that I want. It's just going to take some bullshit to get there. Now I'm going to take some of the same green and put it on this brush. And kind of, you know, <laughs> blend. But I'm going to just like try to cover my whole brow right now. So I can just get rid of that and be done seeing that. It's definitely what I was going for into my brow. James, I promised I watched your video. You said I don't need any texture in my eyebrows and, and that is definitely where I went wrong. I mean, there's more than enough fucking glue in these bitches though. Like, I don't understand. I'm gonna keep going though. I'm gonna get to the end. We gonna see what the fuck I look like. Cause if I look like uh, the fucking Grinch stole Christmas, I'm just gonna rename the title of the video. I just called it something else. I'm gonna take this Perfect Tone Matte Lip Cream by Black Radiance, I'm sorry guys, in purple, but the actual name is called Living in Violet. And since this is a cream, it's gonna work perfect to clean up the shit that I just caused here. Yes, everybody up. I'm almost freaking positive that this is the best I can do, but I just wanna blend a little bit more because that's what the fuck people say you should do. I'm gonna take this dark ass green glitter shit, put it on the bottom of that fucking brush. You know what? I'm gonna use a different brush. I'm tired of it. I'm tired of my shit. I'm tired of my shit. I think I should like leave this makeup on for, so that when my mom wakes up, like I'll like stand like right outside of her door when she gets up to like wake up and go use the bathroom and stuff, and I'll just scare her. She'll probably use the bathroom all on her stuff. So I'm gonna take this eyeliner pencil that's like the darkest brown one I have because I just know I'm not supposed to use um black. That's just a no-no. So I am going to start to shit start to carve my brow you know okay i got this just gonna fill this in slash color it in okay i need to sharpen it more then i'm gonna take this lighter brown i'm gonna sharpen it i just feel like everything is just not sharp enough why is why is it anything sharp enough what have i been doing all this time you know what don't be mad at me guys i'm going to do my eyebrows 
and my eyeliner off camera real quick because I have to be super close to the mirror and I, I really can't hold this and do this because I want this to look good for you guys. So I'm going to come back and do my lashes and my lower lash and then all I got to do is put the wig and stuff on it and I should be ready. Oh, and then the lips. So I still got more stuff to show you, but let me go do my brow and my eyeliner really quick. Okay, so after some long trials and tribulations, I got to this other eye. I got to the brows and I got to the eyeliner. Clearly, the eyeliner is still drying. It dries matte black, which is great. I think that my drag look is definitely coming together. I'm really excited. Only thing I can say, I got a little eyeshadow all over my face. So I'm going to take this setting powder. I'm kind of just going to dust So, I am about to stack two pair of the cheapest lashes I could find at my beauty supply store in the biggest. Um, they're both cherry blossoms, and this is 304, and this is 138. Now, what those mean to the world, I have no idea, but it just means that they're pretty big. <laughs> I can honestly say I'm excited for the lashes. The, light, the lashes always make your look come together, so I just wonder how much, like, bad do I look. <laughs> I, prom I promise I have lashes on, guys. You might not be able to see them, but I promise I do. I'm going to go back to my purple color pigment from Black Radiance. Well, just got that all in my eye. I mean, it's pretty much all I got, so I just got to rock with it. Now I'm going to go and attempt to apply a white liner under my eye. Fuck! Do not buy this white liner. It fucking burns. I don't get it. What's the point of this? I'm not allowed to put it on my face where I need it. Okay, we're getting to the nitty gritty. Next step is bottom lashes and the cover up where I got that eyeliner on that top lash pretty dried out. I'm gonna use it anyway. And now it is time to apply this lip glue. No cleanup on all three here, honey. What I'm gonna do for the finishing touches because I know that this is just gonna make this look go over. I'm gonna take this, that same pigment that I used on my eyes and my under eye. Okay guys, I'm gonna go off camera one more time. I'm very sorry to leave you again. I'm just gonna get the wig, the ornament earrings, and the Santa hat to complete this look. And I'm gonna wash my hands real quick, so. <laughs> I have been inspired by the James Charles. The first cover boy is just so legendary. I just, I live for him and his entire existence. I was following him on YouTube way before Cover Girl. I was very excited when I saw him post his Mrs. Claus drag look. Um, on YouTube. I saw him drop the pictures on Instagram and I'm like, oh shit, I have to go on YouTube and watch that video because I know he went ham. And then as I was watching the video, I mean, I was so inspired. I was like, you know, let me just, you know, hop on the train. And I was like, let me hurry up and do it. But yeah, guys, I just want to, I just want to say James Charles, if you do get to see this video and you hear me talking, I'm talking to you. Thank you so much for all of the boys out there, all the boys our age, all the older men, all the younger boys that will get to do this. It is just, it is such an inspiration to get to see you out there getting it for all of the men in makeup. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Hi, I'm Mrs. Claus. Mr. Claus is at home. He's actually way right now delivering gifts to all of the whores and slores of the North Pole. Also known as your local strip club. <laughs>